Hello, welcome back to Clarita's Corner. Today, we're going to make a carne asada taco recipe. Salt, pepper, oregano, some oil, and carne arrachera, which you can buy at your local Mexican market. Start by marinating the meat. Add about a teaspoon of salt, a teaspoon of pepper, about two teaspoons of oregano, an eighth of a cup of oil, and the rest we'll use when we fry the meat. One whole orange into the meat. Mix that up. And then we'll cover it with saran wrap and put it in the fridge while we make our salsa. We have our tomatillos here. And you can buy these at your local Mexican market. Chiles de árbol, some salt. And add some chiles on there. I'm going to add a little water to cook them faster. While that's cooking, we're gonna go ahead and start chopping up the onion and the cilantro for the tacos. An onion lines our cilantro. I think I've showed you this before, but I like to roll them out so that it's easier to get all that juice. And then we're just gonna cut them in half and then into three. And now we're gonna chop up our cilantro. I like to cut the ends off. Make sure you get all the little leaves. You just start chopping. Chop half of this onion. And there we have our garnish. I'm gonna go ahead and blend the chiles with a couple tomatillos first. That way we can blend the chiles de arbol really well without over blending the rest of the tomatillo. And add the rest of the tomatillos in there. We have our salsa here. Mix that up. Put it to the side and we can go ahead and start with the meat. So now that our meat is nice and marinated, we're gonna go ahead and start warming up the oil. Put about two big spoonful Mexican onion. I call it cebolla mexicana. I'm gonna go ahead and slice them just to get all the juices inside. Go ahead and just throw them in there. Make sure you lay it flat out so that it cooks all the way through. Check back on it in a couple minutes and we can start heating up our tortillas. Two by two, just so that when you put the meat on there, it doesn't your taco doesn't break. We're gonna go ahead and flip that over. So now that it's almost done, we're gonna go ahead and start chopping it up. Let these onions continue to grill. Put it back into the frying pan. Let that cook for a couple minutes. Two tortillas. We add our onion, our cilantro, our salsa. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Extremely delicious. 